Tutorial Keto Cat's Thick Smear In this tutorial we will demonstrate how to perform a Keto Cat's Thick Smear on human stool. This technique is used for the detection and enumeration of helminth eggs, including soil transmitted helminths and schistosoma species. 1. Equipment To perform a Keto Cat's Thick Smear, the following equipment is needed. Scrap paper or a newspaper a 1.5 mm thick template with a hole of 6 mm, a flat-sided spatula, microscope slides, a plastic screen with a mesh size between 60 and 105, hydrophilic cellophane, glycerol malachite green, a wooden tongue depressor, a device to hold the slides, and a compound microscope. 2. Procedure To start, place a small mound of a stool sample on the scrap paper. Place the template with the hole on the centre of a microscope slide. Afterwards, press the small screen on top of the stool so that part of the stool is sieved through the screen and accumulates on top. To collect the stool that was sieved, scrape the spatula across the upper surface of the screen. Then put the stool from the spatula in the hole of the template so that it becomes completely filled. When removing the template carefully, you'll notice that a cylinder of stool is left on the slide. In the next step, take the pre-soaked cellophane strip with a wooden tongue depressor and cover the stool with it. When excess glycerol solution is present on the upper surface of cellophane, you can wipe it with tissue paper. Invert the microscope slide on a smooth hard surface and firmly press the stool sample against the hydrophilic cellophane strip. That way, the stool will be spread evenly between the microscope slide and the cellophane strip. Place the slide in the holder and remove the scrap paper with the stool sample so that you can continue with the next stool sample. Finally, each slide should be examined after 30 to 60 minutes at ambient temperature. By then it is possible to see the print of your scrap paper through the clarified smear. The smear can now systematically be examined and the number of eggs of each species can be recorded. For this template, the multiplication factor used to obtain the number of eggs per gram of stool equals 24. 3. Acknowledgements The raw material for this tutorial was collected during a field study financially supported by an institutional university project of the Flemish Inter-University Council. The Research Foundation Flanders supported the development of the tutorial through a postdoctoral mandate grant.